Hello everyone, we will continue the topic SAP scripts and in this video, we will cover the various types of text in SAP script. If you remember, during smart form also, we covered this topic. In smart form, we have four types of text. Text element, text module, include text and dynamic text. Out of these four types of text, text module and include text are reusable. If you remember, we created the text module through smart forms transaction code itself. Include text we created through SO10 transaction code and we used in the smart form. Now the question comes for the SAP script. Now in case of SAP script, yes, inside every window, whenever you are going for window, you are creating text element. Now the question comes for other types of text. In case of SAP script, we cannot go for text module. So if you have a text module, you cannot use in the SAP script. Same thing is for dynamic text also. We cannot go for dynamic text and we cannot go for text module. The one thing we can only only go for include text. If someone is saying, is there any reusable text which you can, is there any text which you can reuse in the SAP script? Answer is include text. Whatever the text we are creating through SO10 transaction code, yes, we can use in the SAP script. So in case of SAP script, you cannot go for text module. You cannot go for dynamic text. And anyways, we are creating text element. We are always creating text element inside the windows. And yes, now we can go for include text also. So what we will do, I will create a include text through SO10 transaction code. And then we will learn how to use in the SAP script. So I will go to firstly SO10 transaction code. Now, I will give some name to the text. Suppose I will say Z INC underscore text. Suppose I'm creating a include text. I will go for create. I will go for go to change editor. Now, for this particular part, suppose for order details, I'm creating a standard, I'm creating a include text now. Order details. I will save. Now, we will see how to use in the, how to use in the SAP script. Now, I will go to SAP script. I will go to page windows. Now, if I will go to the first window, in this window, order details, we'll check what is the window for the order details. Order details title window. I will double click. It is appearing in blue color. I will go to edit text elements. Now, I will simply, simply go for, go to change editor. 
previously you have written order details now we will not write we will not hard code order details we will simply simply use the include text which we created through so tag so how how we can go through that i will go to insert i will go to text i will go to standard now you can see text object and text id is coming automatically now you need to give the text name what is the text name which we gave in so10 transaction code if i will go to so10 z i n c underscore text z i n c underscore text now what is the language language is english now if you remember during smart form also i showed you how you can check the various details you can go for go to header you can see same to same things we are passing inc text text object language english text id est now i will go for okay now you can see each and everything came automatically what is the name of our include text what is the name of our or text which we gave in so10 this one object text id st language en now we will not go for this previously we hard coded now we are going for include text and many time people will simply say the word standard text also because if you see what is the title bar of so10 if i will show you so10 the title bar is standard text itself so if someone is using the term include text or if someone is using the term standard text do not confuse at that point of time it's same only now i will go to back and now i will simply simply activate now if i will cross check this window text elements now i will go for go to change editor yes perfectly fine now i will run the program and check the out now you can see this order details is now coming through standard text or include text which we created through so10 transaction code so what is the summary of this particular video in this video our major focus is yes how i can use the standard text or include text into the sap script if someone ask you can you reuse a standard text or include text into sap script answer is simply simply yes what you need to do you need to go for the text element of the window and you need to go for insert standard text if someone ask in the interview can you use a text module inside the sap script answer is no if we have a text module we can never never reuse we can never reuse in the sap script and there is no concept of dynamic text also in sap script so we can only only reuse a include text or standard text in the sap script which we created through so10 transaction code so that's it in this particular video thank you